Hello, welcome back to our series of real life applications of LCM and HCF. This is Farhan and he has three ropes of lengths 140 cm, 168 cm, and 210 cm. He wants to cut these ropes into smaller pieces of equal length. How many pieces can he get? What should be the length of each piece? So Farhan has three pieces of rope with lengths of 140 cm, 168 cm, and 210 cm. He wishes to cut all the three pieces of ropes into smaller pieces of equal length, such that there is no leftover rope. What is the greatest possible length of each of the smaller pieces of rope? And how many smaller pieces of rope can he get altogether? If you have been following my previous videos on real life applications of LCM and HCF, you now know that the key to solve word problems is to identify keywords from the question. Can you identify keywords here? Cut ropes into equal length such that there is no leftover rope. So it means we have to find highest common factor HCF. HCF of 140 168 and 210. All three numbers are divisible by 2. So we get 70, 84 and 105 which are multiples of 7. So dividing by 7 gives 10, 12 and 15. They do not have any common prime factor so we stop dividing here. HCF gives us the greatest possible length of each piece of rope which is 2 into 7, 14 centimeter. If we look at the table, first rope measures 140 centimeters. When we divide it into smaller pieces of 14 centimeters each, we get 10 small pieces. Similarly, we get 12 small pieces when we divide second rope and we get 15 smaller pieces out of the third rope. So the total number of smaller pieces is 10 plus 12 plus 15, which is 37. So we can get 37 smaller pieces from the three ropes. Farhan's problem is solved. Stay tuned for upcoming videos.